Hi mum, how are you? Yeah, we just have to take down the decorations, it's depressing. Look, ma'am, I have a bit of news. Are you sitting down? Well, Tom's made a breakthrough in his research. <laughs> no, the, the baby's fine. It's, uh, no, this is our uh, other news. I should have said that at the start. Yeah, well, Tom's made a breakthrough. To be honest, I never thought that I would have a child. We've been partners for years, but... But it was my fault, really. No, I don't want to blame Tom. Look, I always wanted children, but I just couldn't. Well, physically, he could. Really. Yeah, like my, my sperm's mobility is way above average. He has able semen. Look, I decided no. I was raised a Catholic, and having a child outside of wedlock, it's, it's wrong. It's, it's unnatural. And that's the only reason why I didn't get pregnant before this. Now, I'm more of a lapsed Catholic myself, well, although sometimes I'm a bit of a prolapsed Catholic. Isn't that right, Really, Brian? Alan? <laughs> Sorry, uh, it's my hormones. We were partners for years. So after the marriage equality referendum, naturally, we were first in line to get hitched. And once we were, we didn't waste any time trying for a baby. We were like rabbits, except, you know, gay men. <laughs> I love being pregnant. I'm so happy. I'm glowing. Now, no, I do have the usual ailments. Uh, nausea. <coughs> weird cravings. Sensitive nipples. But I wouldn't change it for the world. Though I am looking forward to seeing my dick again. Do you have to be so crude? <laughs> That's why you love me. Is it? Tom is the top okay. researcher at Fairflux Limited where they've recently had a breakthrough in time travel. No, darling, it's actually called temporal displacement. We can't send living material through time, but we can send non-organic material back to a place. Now, basically, they can send things, objects, back in time. Which is why we're making this video, to send back to a place in time. Yeah, just to show an example of how important it is to vote yes in the referendum in May 2015. Wait, if we've already sent this back in time, is this already on YouTube? Yup, uploaded 25th of March 2015. This is weird. What's this bit? This will be us in a few seconds watching the video that we're recording now. Oh, what, so I'm gonna point at the camera over there in a second. Oh. You're right, Alan, this is trippy. You're right, Alan, this is trippy. Temporal displacement is complicated. But this is very, very easy. If you don't vote yes on May 22nd, we may never have a chance to start this family. Yes, please protect this future baby's future and vote yes to marriage equality. Wait, if people have already voted yes to this, then why do we need to send this video back in time? Well, maybe the only reason they voted yes is because they saw this video. Ooh, mind blown. <laughs> Which isn't the only part of me you've blown. Jesus Christ, Alan! <laughs> folks, I'm Alan, and as well as uh, voting yes on May 22nd, why not hit the old subscribe button down there and give it a click, and uh, also check out some sketches and stand-up I do. Sound. As a pound. <laughs>